Hey everybody, okay, I kind of wanted to make this video quick. I won't make it extremely long, um, but yeah. And most of you know I've been wanting to get the Marilyn Monroe piercing, and I finally got it. And yeah, um, well actually, I guess it depends on the side. The Marilyn Monroe was on the, is on the left, and the Madonna's on the right, so I guess you would call it the Madonna, but whatever. Um, if you can see it now. Yeah, it's actually, I just got it like last night for my birthday. Thanks, Auntie. I love you. She got it for my birthday. And I just absolutely love it. And I'm like freaking out. I'm so excited. And um, yeah, it actually didn't hurt. My whole overall experience was awesome. I went to Mark's Tattooing. And um, if you live where I live, um, or anybody, I'm just going to say this for the people who know me. If you're going to go to Mark's, um, make sure you get the guy because he was awesome the experience was awesome he was very sterile like he changed his gloves a few times he wiped down like me and a few times and just wiped down things and just he just was really clean about it um yeah and it was just like a total awesome experience like i would have not traded for the world it was like because my last experience with my belly button piercing like he had a re-pierce my belly button piercing and it was like when i was like 16 and it hurt like heck so yeah but um I'm loving this now I'm really happy um he gave, he gave me like the h2o stuff to spray on it so he says about uh, he said to do it about three times a day and I'll probably do it more because I really want it to be sterile and clean and I don't want to like ruin it and I'll probably do it like if I eat and stuff which I don't think you spray underneath I don't know I just spray over top of it um, they, say, they say it heals from the inside or from the outside in and also uh, wait till it car goes um, yeah I can't wear foundation well he said makeup but I figured my eyes were okay as long as it's not running or anything I can't wear like foundation or anything for three months um, and I can't change this for two months which I probably wait longer this is how I am because I really want it to heal up good so yeah um, yeah, but my overall experience, as far as pain-wise, he clamped it, like he cleaned it off and everything or whatever he did, and then he marked it, showed me it, then he clamped it down, um, and then, like, I felt like a little poke, but it was just him, like, I guess, setting up the needle where he had to stick it, and then he's like, okay, breathe in, so I breathed in, and then when I breathed out, he stuck it through, and honest to God, it did not hurt, on, like, a scale from, like, 1 to 10, it was, like, a 5, it was really not that bad, the only thing I can say that hurt was after when he was twisting the ball on because he said he wanted to make sure it was really tight so it didn't fall off so that was like the only thing other than that it was like awesome and today it's a little sore and there was a little like blood around it earlier but now it's like okay it's just kind of weird when you're chewing because when you're chewing or talking like it goes in and out and in and out and you can feel it it's weird but cool i don't know i just think it's i don't know yeah i'm not playing with it though much like i don't even like i don't twist it they say not to twist it, don't use any like Neospor and any of that stuff, so don't listen to people. Use what the people say to use, because if you want it to heal properly, do what you need to do. Um, yeah, so that's that. I love it, and I just, I think it adds to my look. So, Alright, see you later. I'll keep up a, dear lord, this dog. I'll keep up a process with my healing. Okay, <laughs> bye.